You mentioned collaborating with the customer success team. What have you learned to really drive success with the review program? The customer success team has all of the keys. They are the main person that you want to have very strong relationships with because ultimately when you're doing advocacy activities in general, they're trusting you to not ruin their relationship with the customer, which is very valuable for them. It starts with hopefully having shared OKRs. Because that way, you know, you're both working towards that same goal and it's a shared goal. So everyone is invested in making it happen. And with the the reviews, I worked very closely with the CS team. Gosh, it was a very manual process. Who are the customers that we can make an ask of? Here's the email template for you to send them. Make sure that you use this link so that it incentivizes them with a $50 gift card. And I really recommend trying to build out your, your database if you can, just to make things easier for you. Just pulling a list based off of NPS scores. You know, you want to make sure that customers have been live at least three months on the platform. For us, it's three months at least in order to be able to prove out that value. And making sure that the customers that are being contacted are ones that we feel are going to give us positive reviews, right? You don't, you don't want to reach out to some customers who are maybe not having the best time and are working through some challenges with integrations or things like that. But I would always take the list, review it with the CS team. Is there anyone on this list that you think should not get reached out to? And then from there, working with G2 to send the automated outreach. Um, and they have a phenomenal CS team on, on the G2 side, and they really help us get the, the emails out. But we do it on a monthly basis, and it has really shown results. You always want to reach a little higher than where you think you can go, because that's always our goal as startups, right? We, we need to be punching above our weight, and we have to kind of hold ourselves accountable with that, with the goals that we set.